Hi, Fire Signs. My name is Debbie, and I'm an intuitive reader. And I'm here today to give you guys your bonus reading for all the fire signs out there. Guys, don't forget to smash that like button, share, comment down below, as well as subscribe if you haven't already, as well as check out the link down in the comment section of my book, Putting Back the Pieces that I personally wrote. So let's get into it here. What does the sign of Leo need to know, Spirit? Please show me. Okay. So somebody was very, very quiet towards you, okay? Uh, I'm almost feeling that spirit is basically saying in regards to a relationship here with the Hierophant's hand facing that Four of Pentacles, um, they are not permitted <laughs> to walk back into your life until they are stable. And I say that is because the Four of Pentacles is, yes, it's closed off energy, but it's really about balance here, having it put together, all right? And right after that, Hierophant is a Seven of Cups. So that's that stability in regards to making a decision in regards to this relationship. Could be dealing with a soulmate energy as well. Those Two of Cups, I always feel uh, that uh, for that energy here. I clarified the Seven of Cups with the King of Cups. So they do love you here, but they're kind of tossy-turvy as to how to express absolutely queen of cups here so i do feel with the power couple when you have the king queen of the certain cup or certain sign here doesn't matter if you're dealing with a water or not that's true love to me uh and i feel that there's definitely going to be a final decision in regards to this once they are stable they are going to be coming back but don't lose hope because this is a meant to be relationship i feel and i also feel that spirit really doesn't want you know like joe schmo uh, showing up at your door and saying, hi, I'm Joe and I'm a hot mess. No, they're not going to do that to you. You know, they're going to bring you back somebody stable who knows exactly who, you know, who they are and what they want, you know. So that's what I have for the sign of Leo. I do feel that they will make that decision, but they got to settle their energy first. All right, moving on to Aries. Aries, there is a decision in regards to a relationship. Could be dealing with a twin here or the sign of Gemini. Uh, they, they've come clean. They, they're a Oh, I just heard they're a changed person. Actually, I heard per man. I heard man. Uh, but definitely, I feel that there is a decision now. Uh, definitely, uh, you know, a change here with the death card here. Uh, but I feel that they did you wrong. You know, th things have changed within themselves. They're more balanced now here because you got the king of pentacles. Man, I can't talk today. And they're ready to offer that ace of pentacles to you. So let's talk, Deb. What I'm really feeling here is that somebody did you wrong. Um, I feel like they did a total turnaround in their attitude, in their ways, in their mental state of mind, uh, in their uh, ego. Ego is the word I'm looking for. Their ego has been settled, okay? They now realize what they have done and they have, they, they are. And I, I feel for some, I'm feeling that somebody's going to say something like, no, they haven't. <laughs> I, I just feel that. And, and I feel that also like you, let's see, I can't tell anybody what to do here. But I just feel it's kind of like they are really sincere that they have seriously changed their ways. I'm going to leave it at that. Uh, you make that decision, what you decide to do. But I do feel for whomever is going through this right now, Aries, I feel that they really have seriously changed their ways. They've opened up their eyes and they're ready to pursue the relationship again with you. That's what I have. All right. Moving on to Sag. Sag. That justice kept wanting to come out. Somebody's waiting to speak the truth here to you and open up and explain how they feel about you. Ooh, yeah, wow. Uh, they've been definitely holding back here. They haven't been totally up front with you uh, for quite some time. I I'm feeling for some out there, this is kind of like a... Um, I just heard twin flame. So definitely twin flame involved, but I was going elsewhere spirit. Um, I was feeling like more of a crush 
That's what it feels like to me. Somebody's coming clean here. It's not in a negative way. Uh, they, they just had a hard time expressing that. And they're going to speak the truth to you that they've been postponing and holding off here in regards to that trust. They've had feelings for you for quite some time, but they've been holding within. They haven't been open and up front. Not in a bad way. Uh, that was nice that that finally changed, that energy of that card. But definitely I feel that whoever this is meant for, there was a crush that somebody is now going to open up and explain how they truly feel to you. Now, non-crush uh, peeps out there, I feel that somebody really wants to come clean and communicate and make things right after they kind of uh, treated you wrong with that seven of swords. Oh, you're back to your normal self there. But that was a nice spin there in, initially. Uh, but I do feel that they are going to come clean and communicate, communicate and make things right again between you. Okay. And then, all right. So that is what I have for not just Sag, but for all the fire signs out there. You guys rock. Thank you so much. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye.